Oh, but do we all have beverages? Do you all have beverages? Oh my gosh. Oh my I gosh. Have a oh my gosh. Here we go. We finally did it. We finally, we finally all have beverages to drink out of and pretend that we knew we were alive. <laughs> Amazing. It's all just to stall time until we know. Until we know absolutely certain that we are alive. Hello, good morning, everyone. Oh, yeah. Hail, First comment. Hail and well met, everyone. We're the XNLs, and welcome to the Daily Breather. Yeah. Um, this is day... 327. <laughs> okay. um, day, 38. day 38. Pretty sure it's day 39 or 38. Um, or so we're going to take a moment of gratitude. We're going to send some positive energy out to those who need some healing today. Um, and we're going to play a tune and do a little book uh, contest and uh, tell you what is going on with us today. Uh, the first thing that we're going to do is light two different candles. Um, this one is going to go to all the people who had to evacuate in the Midland area yesterday. There was a big dam that broke, and um, it's just the worst possible time to have something like that happen. And there's lots of people who are working really hard to fix the problem. Lots of people who are adjusting really quickly to um, a massive, massive undertaking and problem. And so all of this positive energy goes out to you, and if you have your own candles at home, uh, feel free to light them and send more positive energy their way. Uh, yeah, it's just a crazy thing to be going on right now. Um, this other candle is for all the people on the front lines. Um, all the people working nonstop to protect and uh, keep us fed and keep our shipments coming in on time and um, everything else that we are deeming to be completely essential businesses. Uh, we're really grateful for all the workers who are making it happen still. Um, and we're grateful for all the people who are struggling right now with quarantine, uh, whether you're quarantined by yourself or you're quarantined in a situation that isn't really your number one favorite thing in the world. Um, we are really thinking about you today. This is a crazy time, but um, we really appreciate you, and you're 100% just as essential as everybody else. So um, thanks for doing what you do. Mm -hmm. And we're going to take a deep breath. So if this is your only deep breath for the day, really um, try to make it count. Get some fresh oxygen and um, you know, send a little bit of this light out. So on the count of three, we're going to breathe in through the nose and out through the mouth. One, two... Three, in. And out. Cool. Alright. Uh, so today I am grateful for Sunshine. I know that we've said it before, but oh my gosh, the next couple of days are going to be like 73 degrees here in northern Michigan, which is like when that happens, you stop everything you're doing and you go take a walk in nature. So that's what we were planning as usual. We live in like this really backwoods area with nothing really going on except for woodpeckers and squirrels. So we're going to take a walk later today and I'm grateful for the time that we have to do that. It's been raining for like the past three days. So. Yes. Um, finally planted my potatoes this morning so we'll see um my daily gratitude um i'm grateful for photographs physical and digital even though i have like ten thousand on my phone i need, need to get rid of the last couple of days i've actually been like digging through um like our google drive and our dropbox and my phone and it's actually been really really kind of lifting me out of this fog that like see these old memories and make me Reminisce. Uh, my gratitude today is towards family, uh, and specifically my sister, Megan, because she is very pregnant <laughs> and is probably going to burst within the next week or so. Oh, Ooh. baby! He came! <laughs> so, my boy! 
Yay! Shout out to my sister. Uh, hope you're doing well. And um, the reason that it made me laugh uh, yesterday was because my family started a, uh, a due date lottery. So everybody in the family chose a date that they think the baby's going to arrive on. <laughs> so... So Here's to play, May 28th. May 28th. <laughs> the first emotion that like this anybody's going to have for this baby is like, dang it, you were born <laughs> on the right day. <laughs> oh, man. So uh, family's, family's in, in good hands today. Everybody say hi to Nashville. My son, he's a good boy, and he's uh, he never really pops his head around when we're doing these all that much, yeah. but every once in a while he just gets clingy. Hi, he's a good boy. Grateful for pets like him who are just uber friendly and um, always want to be part of everything. All right, let's play a tune. Cool. This was our first um, Player Paragon cover that we put Second. out. Was first it? one was Big Thief. No, we put no, this one out. I think first. the playlist was just in. We put it out on January 1st. <laughs> yeah, this was, the, this was the start. Why? I've been looking at the playlist in the wrong order for that long <laughs> yes. and nobody told me. Um, well, we started the whole series because we saw this panel that Brandi Carlisle led, and, um, she was super inspirational, and so we thought, all right, let's, let's, uh, let's learn one of our favorite Brandy tunes, and this is actually one of her earlier songs, right? Oh, yeah, this is off of a very early album, like, one of her first or second, I think. Um, so here we go. One, two, three, four. Here we go. book to recommend. Kate's gonna do it today. Got cat hair all over my nose. <laughs> yeah, this is a, um, a book recommendation from our amazing booking agent, Laura. And we do these weekly Zoom calls with our booking agency and, and she recommended it and Seth picked it up. Uh, it's called The Emotional Life of Your Brain. 
and uh, it's really cool. I just started, you know, checking it out the other day and it talks about kind of like six different patterns. Um, I almost like to view it as like a video game character where you have like different capabilities and levels and you have to like level up your emotional endurance or your, uh, you know, how fast you bounce back from adversity and all these things. So it kind of discusses um, all the different sides of your brain. And I feel like it's similar to a lot of personality tests where like can help you kind of perceive how other people work and perceive how you work a little bit better. So definitely check it out. The Emotional Life of Your Brain by Richard J. Davidson and Sharon Begley. Oh, I'm sorry, Dr. Richard J. Davidson. That is something important that I should read. read I don't know how to read. Um, okay, cool. So um, we got a couple things to announce. We've got a show tonight. Um, it is with... Um, a food drive, a father fed food drive, actually, and um, also 91.6 Petoskey. 96.3. 96.3. I can't read. I don't know how to read. 96.3 Petoskey. Um, we're really excited about it. The, the link to the actual show is in the description of this video, and um, we're going to be going live from their Facebook page, so make sure you get there at 7 p.m. Eastern time. Uh, that's when we'll be starting. And uh, we also have all the books are on the Brilliant Books um, landing page, the XNLs landing page. Uh, so that is also a link in the description of this video. If you click on there, it'll take you to all of the books we've recommended so far. And there are little quotes from our daily breathers <laughs> um, saying like, oh, we think this book is great. And, and like we're like actual book review professional people. It's hilarious. Um, so definitely click on that landing page. <laughs> I like it. <laughs> yeah. Um, but like we this did. This muffin tastes <laughs> bad <laughs> like we did uh yesterday we've got a big collection of books now that we've been doing for the daily breathers and so we are starting to mail them out to you guys um today if you share this daily breather on your facebook page just click the share button um, we are doing a drawing tomorrow and we will send another book out to someone tomorrow randomly so make mm -hmm. sure you share the daily breather and who knows the emotional life of your brain may be yours <laughs> Uh, lastly, we also have a link in the description of this video to a Spotify playlist. It's a Michigan and Again Memorial Day Spotify playlist. Um, and it has a bunch of different Michigan musicians on it. A lot of people are releasing records and songs right now. Mm -hmm. And it's kind of flying by because of the current situation. But we're trying to capture everybody um, putting out music and putting it all in one place so we can all check it out together and support them. So... Uh, please click on the link in the description. There's some songs by Steffi James or Sweetwater Warblers that put out their record. Um, you know, we've been putting out stuff, so uh, definitely check that out. Mm -hmm. Oh, happy birthday, David. Thank you happy for birthday. being here. We we love you. And uh, to Tom Reed, special shout out. He sent a cool little care package in the mail with a cat toy and a bunch of stuff for us to yeah. read. So a uh, huge thanks for that. Um, we... We're really lucky. Um, thanks for thinking of us. All right, guys. Uh, we will see you tomorrow. All right, we'll see you tonight at the show 96.3 Petoskey. Um, food drives are in, like, severe need of support right now. Like, I, I don't know why, but, like, right now more than ever, we have more awareness that it's a necessary thing, but they're not getting the donations that they usually get nearly as much right now. And so... Um, Please consider donating tonight towards um, this food drive because people could really use it right now. Um, so that's basically what that show is about. We're really excited to be a part of it, um, part of the process. And please tune in at 7 p.m. from the 96.3 Petoskey Facebook page. And the link is in the description. Mm -hmm. See you guys tomorrow or tonight. Tonight. See you guys tonight. Ah! <laughs>